Gifts in wills are a really important part of Christian giving and they're a marvellous way of expressing our gratitude and our thanksgiving to God for his generosity to us. In fact, the Church of England has been encouraging people to make wills and by implication to remember the church in them for more than 500 years. A lot of people have already made gifts in their wills. As a result of that, they've provided a lifeline to a number of churches around the country. They've helped to support their mission and keep them alive. It's been a dream for years. We had an old church room and it had become completely past its sell-by date and clearly we needed to do something about it. It was the, the legacy which started the journey because I think without the legacy we wouldn't have had the courage to go ahead. We approached everybody in the community, we sent letters, we had an open day at the village hall and we had a, a tremendous response. Everybody's pulling together, it's really, really good. But it is used every day during term time by a, a preschool. People love it. The parents love it, the kids love it. They've started a toddler's group as well. You know, it's made a real impact on the community, I would say. There are two things we've done with the legacies. The two smaller ones have gone into the path. Um, the path was really quite dreadful and was getting very difficult, particularly for older people or anybody in pushchairs to use. We didn't have a proper uh, wheelchair ramp. There was certainly at least one gentleman who said, uh, you know, until we got the path done, he wouldn't be able to come back to church. And he was delighted uh, when the path was done, and he did indeed do that. So, um, certainly for, for older people, uh, it's made a, a big difference. We announced it to the church that Margaret had left us a phenomenal amount of money and that we had a, 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 an idea that we'd like to refurbish the church uh, in her memory. When we said about taking the pews out, um, they said she'd love that because she, she used to always sit on a cushion on the pews. We've been saving up to do a refurbishment for years and our building fund was only at £10,000 when the legacy came in from Margaret. As ever, God's timing was perfect. We wanted to actually make this space as flexible as we possibly could, not just for worship, but for church-based activities. The wonderful thing about the legacy that was left here and the, what St Luke's have been able to do with the space through that money has meant that we can open up the church at lots of other times uh, to meet our children, young people and families. What's fabulous about the work that we can do here is that we can meet families where they are, offer them what I'm hoping will become a safe place where they can be themselves, where they can come with all their issues and needs and find love here and find hope here and find peace. Um, in a way that they possibly wouldn't experience in other places in this community. Any gift, however large or small it may be, is tremendously welcome and hugely valuable. Mm -hmm.